Welcome! In this video we will explain how to choose the best heat exchanger for your unit. Maybe you will be surprised that it's not just about the highest efficiency. Sit back, watch and relax. <laughs> yes, very good. I <laughs> love you too, Mao. Hey, you! I need you to make me a new air handling unit, even better than the last one, with the highest efficiency. And I want it cheap, and I want it fast. We will earn millions and billions on this project. <laughs> no problem. 95%? My boss will be so happy. This unit will be the best on the market. And I will finally get my own vacation. No, that's out of the question. No, not in a million years. Love you too, Mom. You, what have you done? The unit you make is unsellable. I've employed the best salesmen, spent all my money, and there's no sales at all. The unit is unnecessarily huge, and it consumes too much energy. And everybody wants it just about as much as they want you. But, but, that's the top quality heat exchanger from the most reliable manufacturer of all. Fix it, or get a new job. Hello, John. What did I do wrong? I used the heat exchanger with the highest efficiency. I'm sure you did your best. I'm on my way. Okay. The highest efficiency and low pressure drop do not automatically mean the best choice. Oh, really? To select the best heat exchanger, there also must be considered other factors like the size of the heat exchanger or the unit consumption. But that's too difficult. That requires me to do some terrible mathematics. To make your job easier, we have come up with a unique formula that results in net energy performance. Sounds great! Can you tell me the formula? Yes. But not here and now. Oh. Because our AirSelect selection software will calculate the formula for you. But if you are really interested, Go to our website, click on the optimal heat exchanger parameters in the technology section for more detail. But I need it now! <sighs> Just take a look at our software which you can easily download from our website, unzip and run without installation. And? Yes, the DLL library is included and in the most common coding languages. Even Spanish? But now to the point. You can find the actual result here, but to make it easier to navigate, we use this emoji. Oh, that's too much! Okay, let's slow down. If the smiley turns green, we are done. Okay, but what if I'm comparing two heat exchangers and they both have a green smiley? Excellent question! Then you choose according to which smiley is closer to 18 but not higher. The net energy performance ratio should be as close to 18 as possible, but never higher. The net energy performance ratio should be as close as possible to 18, but not higher. Yes. Green smiley. The closer to 18, the better net energy performance ratio, the more economical heat exchanger. Recusec heat exchangers. I choose... Ooh! I am texting now. No way to guess my mood. John! You've made me really happy. The orders are just pouring in. You will be rewarded. 